Hello, this is Pariah Leviticus, Pariah L, and welcome to Season 1, Episode 2 of Pariah's Solo Legit Adventures. And what have I gotten myself into? Holy cow. Well, here we have the sexy dance floor that we made the other day. Um, let's take a look outside. I don't even remember what I'm doing. It's been a couple days since I had a chance to play. Alright. Looks pretty normal. Actually, let me check and make sure. I don't remember. Yeah, we don't want peaceful. There we go. That's better. Alright, so let's finish up this here house. See if I got enough enough wood to build the whole bloody thing. I think I was saying last time I I actually like to build my house is kind of tallish because I like to put crazy roofs roofs on them roofs what's roofs what's a roof I like to put roofs on my houses and, uh, and today we'll be putting a roof a roof R O V E roof on this particular domicile. Yes. Yeah, so anyway, uh, hey, I wanted to give a shout out to uh, all the people on Twitter lately who have been following me. I am very pleased. Thank you very, very much. That's awesome. And um, a shout out to all of the people on YouTube who followed me. That's pretty awesome. I really appreciate that too. And hopefully together we'll make this an awesome show. Otherwise it will be yet another boring Minecraft uh, let's play that nobody wants to watch, but hopefully that is not the case. Uh, right. I need I need some stairs. I got to build some stairs up in here. So let's do that. We'll build some stairs up in here. And lovely. Oh, God, lovely. I'm going to build a whole boatload of stairs. Because it's important to have lots and lots of stairs. Well, that and because I'm building a roof, you know. So this might not be exactly the the house that most of you would build. I don't know. But this is... Ah! This is the design I like for a house. It feels homey. I usually build them... Oh, for God's sake. I usually build them two levels, maybe three sometimes, depending... Okay, we're just going to get block lag. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Seriously, oh my god. Uh, yeah, so anyway... Oh. So anyway, apparently I can't build a stairway up to my second level here because I'm an incompetent. There we go. Ah, thank you. Okay, now, let's, I don't know if you guys heard that boop boop, that was my iPhone, that is also plugged into my computer here, running the latest evasion jailbreak on it, and I believe it's just finishing up, which makes me very happy. Um, I think it must have come out yesterday or today, I'm not really sure, but seems to be pretty cool so far. Nothing's caught fire, which makes me happy. Okay. I hear something walking around the perimeter. I wonder what it is. Dirty, dirty monsters and horrible creatures of all natures. Mm -hmm. Well, it looks like my jailbreak worked just fine. I'm so happy. My jailbreak, rather. 
Looks like it worked just fine. I'm so happy about that. But we're not talking about that right now because this isn't a jailbreaking your iPhone movie or video. This is a let's play some survival Minecraft together and listen to Pariah talk in stupid voices type of video. Because that's what I do. I should tell you too about uh, some upcoming videos that we're working on over at Swiss Family, Swiss Family Minecraft, uh, which is our YouTube channel. Um, what we got coming up for you is the official Swiss Family Minecraft video, Season 1. Uh, that should be coming out in a week or so, hopefully, if I can get everybody together on it. And basically, it's um, it's sort of part survival, part animation, part pre-scripted movie type thing. Um, sort of along the same lines as, as Lost, except much, much more humorous. Um, and the main players in it are myself, uh, my wife, Anique V., my son, Deathy Eye, and my daughter, Vivian B. And it's going to be pretty awesome because we're all in it. And that's why it's Swiss Family Minecraft. Uh, I'm going to cut some holes for windows here. I like windows. I like lots and lots of windows. Which is kind of silly considering the fact that I build all this wood stuff and then I go back and cut all these windows in. But whatever. It's the way I do it. Deal with it. If you don't like it, go watch somebody else's video, doggone it. Uh, we'll just make... We'll just make those. I hear something walking around. I wonder what it is. Whoa! That was suck. Stupid creeper. Anyway... You'll notice that my house did not blow up. Uh, I mentioned in the first video that is because, even though this is legit, I do use one game rule, which is the mob griefing off, because I absolutely hate it when creepers blow my stuff up. I don't care if they blow me up. That I can deal with. In fact, half the time it's more funny than anything else. But when I've spent a bunch of time making something and they blow it up, uh, I want to punch them in their creeper throats. Good God. Oh, an Enderman. Yay. Yay. Hooray. He's out there making weird guinea pig noises at me. <laughs> Stupid Enderman. I'm going to just stand up here. What are you guys going to do? I say, and then probably get shot by a skeleton. I'll just talk smack until I die. Get out of my way, leaves. Alright, I need some more wood. And what man doesn't, really, when you get right down to it, you know? I think my wife would probably agree. Stupid tree limbs. Hate them. They look cool, but they make it really a hassle to cut down trees. And up with lumps of floating tree lameness. Oh, you'll notice too, I, I hopefully up the ante on the video a little bit this time. I, uh, had a couple of you watch the videos mentioned that, that uh, it was kind of low resolution and pixely, and I appreciate the the heads up. I uh, this is actually um, the first time I've ever done anything like this. I mean, this isn't my first video, but the first time I've ever ever uh, taken a hand at producing videos for YouTube. So I'm still learning. I'm still learning. Do you hear me, lads? I'm still learning to produce content that's worth watching. Oh, and here I am getting my arse kicked. Oh, go away. Go away. Why are you attacking me? It's the middle of the day, you jerk spider. T 
take your jerky spider self elsewhere. I didn't even touch you. It's the middle of the day. You should not be attacking me. You should be happy in the middle of the day. Come here, dummy. I'm gonna hit you with this air sword. Come here. Ah, stupid spider. Alright, I give up. I don't want to fight him anyway. Ooh, piggy. Hello, piggy. Here I come. Die. Die! Die, vile pig! With your pink piggy self and your little curly tail! Yes! Die and furnish me with the food! The stuff of life that will keep me alive! At least until that spider comes out of the tree and kicks my bloody ass all over this continent. Die. Die. Yes. I now have pork. Pork to sustain. You know what's messed up in real life? I don't even like pork. But in Minecraft, I'll eat some pork. What the hey? I mean, what can it hurt, really, when you get right down to it? I mean, don't get me wrong. I don't not like pork for, like, religious reasons or anything like that. I, uh, I just think pork is gross, personally. But, you know, that's just me. And that might be part of why I have a vendetta against all things pig-like. I will kill them when I see them. They have nothing to offer me except for pork. Alright. I need an axe. This is... This is terrible. It's a trick. Get an axe. I hear a big dumb skeleton. Oh, I hope he notices me before I notice him. That would be awesome. And why? Why are all these monsters out in the daylight? Seriously? What did I do to deserve this? Honestly, I'm just this poor guy. Lost in the middle of the wilderness. Just appeared here one day. And I'm just building a house. Somebody's always got to come and ruin it. Yes, I think I will attack you with my boniness and my stupid zombiness and my creepery blow up y TNT ness. I will attack you and I will take all the things that you hold dear, sir. And I will spread them over the landscape in a, a miasma of crazy tools and items and things and stuff. Oh, God. I need... You know what I need? I need some birch trees, man. Oh, there's that spider. I'm gonna go kick him in the ass end. What's up, dude? Yeah, you're stuck under a tree, aren't you? <laughs> Give me that. How many, how many strings do I have? One. Come on, now. I need me some more strings so that I can make me a bow and arrow. I need a bow and arrow. Bow and arrows are good for shooting things long distance. Like creepers and zombies. Needs me a bow and arrow. That sounds a little messed up. I don't know if I want to say that anymore. Yes. Yes, indeed. I think I mentioned in the the last episode that I always find it amusing that you start off Minecraft by punching trees. I want to see any of you in real life just start out your day. Just wake up in the morning, in the middle of the park or whatever, and just roll up on a tree and straight up ham fist punch that tree. Man, it's really hard not to curse. Anyway, uh, yeah, I just want to see that happen because that would be pretty funny. Watch a bunch of big burly men in the park crying because they broke their fists on trees. That's my idea of a good day. Watching burly men cry in the park. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Uh, Alright. I think we got almost enough birch right now to complete layer one. Rawr. 
I will destroy you leaves. I should be picking up some of these. Yeah. Some of the saplings. See, I like to build, uh, I like to build tree farms. It's kind of like my thing, yo. Because, you know, you have a constant supply of wood, which is nice. And, uh, I don't know, it's aesthetically pleasing. Alright, let's... You know what? This is a, a message straight to Notch. We need birch bark canoes. We've got birch bark. Let us craft birch bark canoes. That would be sweet. Or like when you go to craft a boat with birch bark, it becomes a canoe. That It should just be an automatic thing. The auto birch bark canoe. That would be awesome. And then Pariah L should get credit for it because he came up with that awesome idea. He being me, being the guy talking to you right now. Alrighty. Uh, really? I've only been playing this game for a couple of years. I mean, God forbid I'd know what I'm doing by now. Pathetic. Everybody watching this, all two of you are going, uh, really, dude? Where did you learn to play Minecraft? Oh, that would be at the Idiot's Home for Elderly Minecraft Players. Oh, there's a funny story. I uh, I had a guy follow me on Twitter. Nice enough guy, you know. And hit me up. And we started talking and just talking about different stuff. And I don't know why, but the uh, the subject of... Um, oh, I remember. I, I put up a, a picture on my... Or I tweeted a picture of um, our awesome recording studio, which is nothing more than the laptop that I'm currently playing on this... Or playing this on. And Bandicam. <laughs> Right. And so <clears throat> the in the picture, you can see my reflection in the laptop screen. And so he hits me up and he's like, well, dude, I, I can't see your face. Who are you? And I was like, oh, I'm a man of mystery or whatever. And he's like, no, you're not a man of mystery. Tell me who you are. And so whatever. So he went back and forth on that for a minute. And then I was like, all right, cool, cool. And uh, so I took a picture. Well, I mean, I didn't like take a new photograph. I had a picture on my hard drive of that a buddy of mine shot where uh, I was at a uh, this girl's birthday party playing guitar and it's kind of a cool picture my my buddy who took pictures a professional photog and whatnot and so it came out pretty cool and whatnot and I'm sitting there looking you know halfway not disgusting and uh, I send the picture and he's like oh that's not you that's not you that's some old dude <laughs> And I'm like, really? No, that's me. And uh, I was like, no, that's you know, that's me. I told him, you know, where the picture came from, that my buddy took it and whatever. And he's like, well, you must be like 36. And I'm like, well, thanks. That's that's awfully nice. I'm actually 43. And he's like, 43? I should be afraid to talk to you. There's just somebody who's 43 and playing Minecraft and wasn't one of the guys that created it. And I'm like, really? <laughs> so, like... Am I the old guy playing Minecraft? I mean, has everyone forgot, like, you know, people that are also my same age, like, you know, some of the Shaft guys and Paul Soares Jr. And, you know, I mean, come on, seriously, just because, like, 90% of you are, like, 16, all right, or 15 or 8, like my daughter, <laughs> you know? So what? Minecraft's fun. I still play with Legos, too. You want to fight? I'll take you. I'll, we'll go outside. I'll punch you right in the eye. Okay, I'm not really punching anybody in the eye. Anyway, so, uh, yeah, I just thought that was kind of a, a funny thing to have happen. <laughs> it's like, really? I can't be the old guy playing Minecraft. Whatever. Whatevers. Whatevs. Oh, it's getting dark again already. God, the days go so quick. The time's fun when you're having flies. Well, I heard that. Yeah, thanks, Kermit. Oh, man. I feel like I'm building slower than I have ever built in my entire life. Man, I still need to find some sheep, because I needs me a bed. This is a bunch of bunk. You know what, though? I don't care. I'm going to go out, and I'm going to start fighting. I'm going to start kicking some heavy-handed butt. Actually, I'm probably just going to go out and get my butt handed to me. That's all right, too. It'll be fun. What the hay? What the hay? What the hay, said the starving horse. 
Uh, we'll make another crappy wooden sword. Even though I believe I said in the last video that you should never have to make more than one of each wooden tool. Because once you use it up, or once you've used it up, you should already have yourself some nice stone tools or some iron tools or God forbid some diamond tools. Oh, diamonds. Diamonds. Diamonds, I love you. Come here. Come here. Come here. Oh, don't even give me string. I hate you. All right. That's it. It's over. It's spider quest. Start whooping some spider butt until I get some string, which, by the way, also comes out of spiders' butts. So while I whoop their butt, I get strings from their butts. Really, it's kind of circular, and not their butts, but the, the logic surrounding the fact. And here we have some coal. I like coal, thank you very much. Give me the coal, yes. And give me some dog on cobblestone. So I can start making some stone implements. Stone implements of destruction. Why do I hear a skelly? Oh, crap! Oh, buddy. By the way, new skeleton accuracy and speed. Painful. Die! Oh, my God. So evil. I love it. You know, honestly, and I think a lot of you will probably agree, Minecraft was starting to get, not not bad, but starting to get maybe a little too easy. So it's nice that some of the mobs are getting a little bit of an upgrade because, you know, it adds a little thrill to it. It's actually kind of, you know, frightening to go out at night occasionally rather than just wandering through and just laying waste to everything. Although I suppose it could be argued that I am playing on normal, and if I was a real man, I'd be playing on, you know, hardcore or whatever. And I do. I play on hardcore sometimes. Actually... I did for a while, quite often, but I don't know. I, I hate on hardcore when you, you build all your great stuff, and then you die, and then you lose everything. That kind of sucks. But, I mean, that's kind of the whole point of hardcore, so I guess I can't really say too much disparaging about it. And I would never say anything disparaging about the finest game ever created. I'm talking about Minecraft, in case you were wondering. All right, I got to make some food here because I'm starving. I'm starving and I'm hurt. And I needs me some food. All right. Oh, yes, give me pork. Pork, which I don't even like to eat. But I'm going to eat it. Oh, yes. Yes, I am. Give me. Hello, pork chop. I'm going to name you Evan. Evan the pork chop. Oh, Evan, I'm so sorry I've devoured you. Well, I'll have to get another. I shall call you Theodore. Theodore the pork chop. We should be best friends to. Oh, there it goes. Sorry, Theodore, you've been eaten too. Ding. Alright. I feel better. Time to go back out and kick ass and chew bubblegum. But I'm all out of ass. Or bubblegum. Or something. Really? Two of them. Right there. Man. Alright. Come on, Skelly. No! You cannot be that accurate. Oh, so lame. So lame and so accurate. And I love it! Let me get to the sand over here. It needs me some. I needs me some sand. Three, four, five, six. Let's go back to our little house. Our little house in the woods. That is shaping up nicely thus far. It's not perfect, but it's not bad. All right. Take that. Take that. Oh, man, I'm never going to have enough to get all six of those. I need some window panes. Which means I'm going to need to go find more coal. Let's see, what's going to be? What's going to be? Sorry, taking a quick quick smoke break. 
while you, while we watch <laughs> while you watch the video of my furnace rendering sand in the glass cuz that my friends is excitement that is adventure that is everything you tuned in to see yeah okay let's do something else while that's thinking anyway Alrighty, 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 alrighty. Let's go back over here and see if there's any more coal in this little in this little cutout that we've got over here. Oh, hello, Creeper! What's up, buddy? What's up? Don't get mad. Don't get mad. Don't blow up, buddy. Really? Come on. How far do you have to get away from the doggone things now? That's alright. My bad. Could have used that TNT, too, to blow stuff up or something. You ever notice that? It kind of makes a little beat. today. I'm not in a beatboxing mood. Maybe I'll beatbox later. Because, you know, beatboxing equals fun. Yes, kids, he's just as incompetent at mining as everything else he showed you thus far. It's amazing what can be done by an old guy playing Minecraft. Yeah, baby. What's up, creepy? I don't want to fight you just yet. All right, now I want to fight you. Oh, God. Stuck in a corner. All right, where are you? Oh, you bastard. Really? Oh, God. God, how fast you bastards shoot now? Seriously? Jeez. Gimme. I don't even remember what I'm doing anymore. Oh, I remember. I remember. I know what I'm doing. I know. God. What am I gonna... <laughs> a bunch of arrows. I have an arrow in my chin. I used to be a great warrior, but then I got an arrow in the chin and the knee. And the foot, and the butt, and the elbow, and the thigh, and in the back of the head. But still I live! Still I live, damn you! You cannot destroy me with your arrows! No matter what portion of my body you fire them into! Fire them into my eyes! I shall live anyway! Alright. I'm going to make some charcoal, because by golly, I'm just sick of waiting. Come to me, charcoal. Come to me. Oh, let's, let's make some glass panes so I can put some glass in here so these idiots don't attack me in my house. Let's fortify. Let us fortify! Doink, 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 spag, spork. Grok. Mumble. Rag. Herg. Gurg, gurg, gurg. Alright. That should keep me safe from there. So, unless anything lands on my roof, like, you know, anything, and comes down the stairs into my little den of iniquity with my sexy dance floor. Sexy dance floor. I should be okay. Alright, we're going back outside. It's daylight. It's daylight and I'm not scared of... Ow! Oh, I hate you. I hate you so much. You should be out in the sun dying. But no! You're standing there getting hit with a sword. Also dying. Alright. Hello, son. 
Hello, Daylight. Welcome to another wonderful day in the world of Minecraft. And that brings us to a close of this episode, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, wait, let me kill this creeper first. Maybe we'll go out with a bang! <laughs> Bad joke. Okay. Uh, thank you for watching. I'm Pariah L. from Swiss Family Minecraft. And uh, if you like this video, thumb it up. If you didn't, thumb it up anyway, because I'm needy, and I need somebody to help me a little bit. Also, subscribe, please, because it's awesome, and it'll make your mom proud of you. And uh, join the family. Come and, uh, come and watch our videos, and soon you'll be able to watch Swiss Family Minecraft, the Island Adventures, or whatever we decide we're actually going to call it. And uh, also, check out my other series, uh, Pariah's Night World, where it's night all the time and kind of scary, and I make redstone stuff. Oh, and by the way, I'm totally a new redstoner. So, for redstoner. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to touch that one. Anyway, um, totally a noob at it, and I'm terrible at it, but I got a lot of chutzpah, and I like to build interesting things. Um, so... We shall see. We shall see what happens. Maybe I'll become one of the preeminent redstoners. Maybe I won't. Maybe I'll always just kind of suck at it. But you know what? You'll be with me on the journey, finding out together, learning, being one. All right. Thanks, guys. Much love and props to all and shout outs to everybody who followed and all that good stuff. And I'll see you next time.